my second home, the Atlantis Hotel in Dubai. And as you can see in the distance, that is the palm. And you've also got the skyscrapers. And we're in the west wing. And this is our swimming pool. And um, the other swimming pool around the front is the Royale. And that's the one we will be in most of the day. And we'll be going up to the water park. And I'll give you a nice view of that. Over by there is an helicopter landing pad. And um, very nice. Everybody, say hello Cody. Hello. This is me and Cody and we're in the Atlantis Hotel in Dubai and we're going to give you a little tour now of the infinity pool. So, let's have a little look. Okay, we're in the pool now and as you can see it's an infinity pool which means the water runs off the edge. So we're going to swim all the way out now to those little bowls over by there. Well, because that's the end of the pool. So if we go all the way up to there... And what's left? Hmm? Left. Um, in the bowl? Yeah. I don't know. What is in the bowl? Stingrays. A what? Stingrays. stingrays. No, there's no stingrays in the bowl. The stingrays in the sea. Stingrays in the sea. In this? In the sea it is. Not in the pool. Well, stingrays in a fish shop? Yeah. Well, can I eat stingrays? No. Oh, why would they be in the... Oh, in the aquarium. Yeah. Right, I got you, all right. Yeah, yeah but it's in the sea. Yeah. There's stingrays in the sea. Yeah. yeah. That's where stingrays come from. So, these are life jackets, which are issued. And here's Brad. Say hello, Brad. Hi. Yeah. So, we'll have a quick look at the hotel now, as we're swimming outwards, and as you can see, it's got plenty of rooms. And then as you come down here, that is the penthouse, which is very posh, and you go along, and then there's, that's the actual hotel, as you can see. Then, there's a massive water park, which I will show you some more later. And then there's dolphins up the top end, huh. and a Starbucks, and I'm going to have a, a coffee munchy nanny nanka dunka dunka. Cody's going to take off the camera. Fingers. So, we're going out to the end of the infinity pool. And there's the monorail. Infinity 
So this is your tour of the Olympics. Abby, you mustn't put your finger on that area there. I'll keep it off. <laughs> 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 Hi, Abby. 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 Hi, Yeah, well, your video in your Alex, so you just got to hold it. Okay. So, that's it, hold it one handed, eh? Okay. Like you can you got hold it steady, mate. Okay. <laughs> this is the old chair. And, and, and this is the old chair. We're in, we're in, what, we're in? Three so roads. What? Three three so roads. No, you're in Dubai. It's Dubai. Gladiator, are you ready? Ready. Gladiator, are you ready? ready? Let's go. This is the battle. This is uh, Smarty the Giant taking on Cody the Midget. And they are having a big splash out here. Cody, Cody's having it on the full attack. He got his eyes squinted. Oh my God, the giant has fell. Oh dear me. This is... Water fighting at his best. Hey. Get on here and run and jump to me. See if you can reach me. Right, fast as you can, straight over to me now. On marks, set, I catch you. This is me and Cody reporting from the Atlantis Hotel. We have got a race going on now. We've got the giant. Marty, and we've got the little fat Justin Bieber double, double Bradley. <laughs> so they're gonna swim over to the other side of the pool. Smarty's doing his warm up exercises, and Bradley's just sitting here. Right, on your mark, Come on, Justin. Get set, go! <laughs> Bradley's flat out now, thinking that he's in a race. <laughs> It looks like Smarty. Too quick, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> you just got owned. Number nineteen. Number nineteen.
mini bar which is uh, two bottles of cognac a couple of cokes and a bit of tea chest ice bucket with tea and uh, as you can see two lovely beds which are absolutely superb a little table and chairs a nice big balcony and then I can do a quick look around the bathroom and uh, I've got the closet with the ironing board etc very nice, and then we're going to the bathroom, plus, uh, here is Mila, and then we got the uh, shower, French shower, and you can be there for washing your feet, then you've got a bath there. Now we've got a little changing room, and uh, we've got this one, and uh, as you can see, we've got a little baby in this room. Out for the moment, but there's the push chair, and they've got a balcony, but you can't walk out on. But it's very nice, and there's the view of the one and only and the heliport, and the pool. A bit of activity going on down there. And uh, we've got the one and Brad. Big fat guts, he's uh, just in the bathtubble. So Cody can run back and forth when the ladies are getting ready, he's with us, and then in the night he sleeps with the ladies. Uh, job done. So this is our room, and I'm going to do a little walk now to the elevator. Right, got your car there, really? Yeah. Sorted. So, we'll take a little tour down here now. Do that. 
Very famous. Just the tall things. Just can be this. zero entry because everybody's in there and then you've got tennis courts conference centre all down this area and uh, as you can see you've got the, the royal pubs where they generally spend their time which is very nice and as we move along we've got the avenues with the shopping and then you've got the shuttle which is this area here and then you've got the lazy river and every And here's me look surfing. Me, 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 me. Okay, so we can move on. Where are the lights So my limp is slack, starting to go now because I just had double painkillers and a quadruple whiskey, and I can feel the building moving now. So it's Actually, stop here, then. Yeah. Yeah. Was it using the leaf paint? Can I see them, please, sir? You certainly can. Thank you, sir. Security is superb. Thank you. <laughs> Where he opens the door, all the, all the, all the stuff shoots out. Right, now we'll move along. And um, this is the uh, Royal Pool. Now you can have the VIP Carabook Cabanas, which are these over here. You buy them for about 25 quid a day. Um, then you've got the normal beds. Now we'll come up and see all my fat friends. Papa Smurf. Yep. I just had pink, pink, pink colours and whiskey, and I'm sorted now. After lunch, if we go up here for two, we can have a good couple of hours. Then. Well, I'm going to go for Pink Street now, Chris. Yep. Okay. So we'll two o'clock. Eh? So I'll just be back by that first. Back here at two. Yeah, and then we'll just walk out here. Alright then. Up there, get back in and 720's out bus, so 720 we're going to Empress. Okay. This is uh, Smarty and Brad and they are now gonna go and do the leap of faith. Okay boys, go for it. Go! Right then we got a tank a tank full of 
sharks and we got a couple of stingrays. There you go, look at that. This is the leap of faith and uh, I'll wait for him to get up the top. There's Brad, he's up on the top. What's your pin number? We've already got the card. What's your pin number? The leap of faith. Couple of scuba divers down here. Here's Brad. Yeah. Smarty. He's going for it. His legs are now over and he's going. Yeah. How do you feel? Can he? Yeah. Put flip flops on. Come on in, just get in that water, I'm, I'm, I'm about to have some stroke. How do you feel, Chris? Good? Yeah. Just look at the elbows, do touch. No, no. Oh, no, but. Slip some water. Here we are at the Atlantis Hotel and uh, all the staff now have been laid off due to the climate and the exchange rates and the recession. They've done now, they've gone, they've got the lifeguards and they've gone into child labour. Dun, dun, dun. They're training the kids up now so they can sit on the chairs and look good and see how they get on. Let's have a look how they perform. Drown! Now watch the kid leap into action. Yes, he's doing a very good job there. And, and the bloke is drowned in. Quick, drown some more. He's drowned in. He hasn't got long left. He's gone into the water. And there's the kid. He hasn't moved. This is... This is the kind of lifeguard child labour is going to do. Yep. Yep, and the kid is still... Looking cool, through the glasses, there's nothing happening whatsoever. Yep. That's it, the last breath now, the last dying breath of the man. The kid thinks he's waving to him and there he is. Alert. He's, he's alert. He's like a tiger, eagle eyes, looking and scanning the pool to make sure that nobody's drowning. The half. Oh, he's coming now. All oh, right, he's made a move now, but I think it's too late. Here's the movement. He's, he's, oh, he ain't even diving in. He's going down the steps. All right, okay, he's taking his time. And. Oh, he's got a smile on his face. Good dive. Oh. Bring in. Yeah, that's a good effort. Bit of underwater action. Oi, pulling his ear. That must be the first aid training he had. Excellent. So to all you other pools in all the other countries, child labour is the future. This is Cody and Candy, 
Then they played tug of war. Here goes Cody now. He's on the he's anchor man on the tug of war. Lost that team. Cody, you're 
in Ferrari world. It's strange but it is. So this is Ferrari world, this is the main entrance and we're walking in and um, all the badges for Ferrari. Now I'm a Lamborghini man myself so they've got to convince me now not to be a Lamborghini guy no more, to be a Ferrari man. So we'll see how they get on in converting me.
What do you think, Code? Just <laughs> Here's the boys, and they're on the F1 race track. Glyn and Brad racing, Di and Smarty. Well, just put your thing in Glyn's bag. There's nothing there you can't see. roller coaster it um, looks absolutely superb 
The straight is the acceleration, which is not to 286 kilometers in four seconds. Then you climb up to the top and then you roll around. Smart is trying to say he's not going on it. He just went on two things just as bad. Acceleration here, Chris. It'll probably make you squint at the end, like. Squint at the end? Yeah, you know, like, uh, it'll probably take you right up to the, the maximum G, like. Watch our little laugh to find out what time it goes off. This is the Mission Impossible movie set, and there you have a signed clapperboard by the director and Tom Cruise, and also you got the picture signed by Tom Cruise, and you got the director's chair. I broke mine now, Brad. <laughs> 